What's up everyone, it's Kerry here for another video. So I just recently finished editing and I just uploaded, I think it's the reaction is getting finalized on YouTube because I think it's almost complete so it will be published pretty soon, like in a couple of minutes probably. Um, that is the Mortal Kombat 11 reaction and this is the Marvel Ultimate Alliance reaction. So yeah. And after this, the Captain Marvel trailer reaction will be going on after this because I just finished editing it, but I kind of want to get everything fully edited and post it um, all tonight and tomorrow on Friday. Daredevil reactions and Saturday and Sunday will be Flash um, episodes seven, no six and seven, and Legends, just Legends reactions and yeah. Um, and um yeah i think that after that i'll be all caught up in on oh yeah sunday is the crossover i believe it starts yeah sunday it will start with the flash on special night because the flash and super cool will switch nights for the crossover so yeah, that's what i expect that to be uploaded so yeah so this is interesting because i think this is what that big avengers game that they were teasing I don't know if this is it just another Marvel game. They're going to announce that Avengers game later. But this is Marvel Ultimate Alliance 3. Now, I vaguely remember playing the... F f I can't even remember if it was the first or second one. It's like years ago on the 360. That's why I remember. And this is weird because it looks like it's a Switch exclusive. This is just a trailer that I just... like. I, I typed it in YouTube and this is the first one that I found so I don't know if this is true if this is a switch exclusive but yeah it's gonna be interesting if it is a switch exclusive and I do have a switch so I'm not sure I'll probably have to buy an actual capture card because that's probably the only way I can actually get good footage without actually recording my actual switch when I play it because that quality won't be good but yeah but anyway, um, yeah, this is Marvel Ultimate Alliance, um, announcement trailer. So yeah, without further ado, let's get right into the reaction. Idiots. Your stupidity may have doomed the universe. Nebula. Wouldn't be the first time, sweetheart. <laughs> okay, the Guardians. The Black Order. So... Is this kind of based off of Infinity War? That's okay. Okay, Ultron. It's vaguely based off of MCU. Well, some of it anyway. Alright. Oh, these Sentinels. Alright. Okay, gameplay actually looks pretty good. Okay. Ooh, Grigon with the time stone, I think. Thor. I think that's the soul stone I just saw. Whoa. Whoa, the whole team together. I can't tell if that's the, all, the entire cast of it. Okay, so it's going to be called Ultimate Alliance 3 The Black Order. Exclusively on Nintendo Switch 2019. Alright, Thanos. Alright. Alright, guys, so um, I kind of stopped recording last night because I, I needed to take a shower, and afterwards I was just really tired. Um, so I decided to save the reaction, um, or save the um, <clears throat> review slash breakdown portion of the reaction later of the Ultimate Alliance 3 trailer. And, um, yeah. I also turned off all my phone, all my devices. I did not want to know anything about the Avengers trailer. So, yeah. So, I know absolutely nothing about it. Um, I don't even know the title. I wanted to make sure I didn't know the title. I want to know it myself. So, yeah. Um, how it's going to work, I'm going to finish uh, editing my um, Ultimate Alliance trailer. And I'll upload that. I already have my Captain Marvel show, so I'm going to upload that too. And then I'm going to... Right after the Avengers trailer and Daredevil, so yeah, um, a lot of videos today on Friday and tomorrow and Sunday is 
I'm gonna try and get all my reactions done tomorrow. Um, my, uh, like, my Flash Episode 6 and 7 reactions and my Legends reactions. Um, so yeah. So let's just go by this trailer uh, piece by piece. Kind of like a breakdown part of it. Um. We don't really need the, um, audio that big. Alright, in our first shot we see, um, Gamora, I mean, not Gamora, no, Nebula talking, talking to the Guardians. Then we do see the, uh, members of the Black Order. Um, you see, I can't remember, Proximate Night, Obs uh, Claw Obsidian, I already forgot who that guy is, and Evan. And I think it's Ebony Crawl or Claw. I can't remember. And that's um, the Black Order's army in the background. Can we do see a uh, Gru? And I think that's a Kree soldier. That's fine. So we do see this is like on a ship. So it might be on like a Kree ship or something. Yeah, because we do see like um, the Guardians actually fighting the Kree members, so it looks like um, the Kree are going to be kind of some en enemies in the game too. Okay, we see Iron Man, and then we see Ultron with um, the. Um, I'm gonna go by the MCU um, Infinity Stones because the comics and other TV shows have different colors. So yeah, um, the Mind Stone. So it looks like this game, some parts of it anyway are going to be based off the MCU because we do see um. Ultron's like um army in the background that their colors their lighting is kind of blue similar to that of Age of Ultron. Can we see Iron Man with his uh Unibeam, I think that's how you what you call it. Do we do see um the rest of the Avengers? We see um Um Yeah, we see um Iron Man with um Cap and we see a Hulk and Thor with Gamora in the background there. Now that scene right there is probably at, um, I'm going to assume this is Avengers Tower. I can't tell who what this thing is because I don't think that's a Sentinel. I think that's something else. And I think that's Thor right there. It could just be like a statue of him. Okay, do we see Sandman here? We do see Spider-Man fighting in a prison with some villains. Or here we do see Spider-Man with... Um, I'm going to assume the Guardians, and I'm think this is the Foot Clan, but no, not the Foot Clan, the Hand Clan, not the Foot Clan. That's from Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Uh, sorry, I just like woke up from a nap. So yeah, let's see Cap find more Ultron robots. Okay, now we see the Sentinels with Wolverine. Okay, we see Wolverine. Um, with the Guardians in the background, I think. Yeah, we see Captain America and, um, Star-Lord in the background. Okay, we did see, um, Kingpin with... Or this is interesting, we see Kingpin here. Uh, alright, first we do see a, a shot of, um... Ronan the Accuser with, um, I can't tell if Ronan has the Time Stone or not, but we see Kingpin here with the Power Stone inside of his, um, I don't know, Kane, I guess, whatever that is. And we do see Nebula here with the Kree army. And we see Green Goblin with the Time Stone, I think. So this is a little interesting. Um, not really too sure what's going on here. Maybe like different villains that are like assembling together, and each villain has like a Infinity Stone or something. Do you see? Um, I think this is Apocalypse. I can't tell. I think it is so. Actually, I cannot tell who that is now. That could be like a Super Sentinel or like a new Ultron robot. We see Thor find some more Ultron robots. We see Proxima Midnight with that other guy. I can't remember this name. Okay, now we see um, Ebony Ma Claw, what, Crawl, whatever his name is, um, with the Soul Stone. At least I think that's the Soul Stone. Because it is unclear if they're going, if the Infinity Stones are going to be based off the movies or they're going to be based off the comics. Now we see more members of the Black Order. We 
we see Nick Fury with um, kind of like the roster in the background. We see um, Wolverine, Gamora, Black Widow, Iron Man, Thor, Cap, um, Drax, Rocket, um, Groot, Falcon, Hulk. Oh, crap, I forgot the Inhuman names. I forgot that. Um, Scarlet Witch, um, Star-Lord. Uh, I can't remember who her name is. I think it's like Jessica something, and I, can't, for the life of me, cannot remember his name. But I do remember him from the comics, but I just can't remember his name at the top of my head for some reason. We see Spider-Man here, and it kind of looks like this costume is the um, black and red costume from in Homecoming, but I could be wrong. It could be like the lighting of the um, animation of the game, but it does look that way. And here we see Ultimate Alliance 3, the Black Order. Coming exclusively on Nintendo Switch in 2019. Yeah, because here's why I thought this was based off the movies. Because the way the Infinity Stones are lined up. They're lined up exactly like they are in Infinity War. Um, if I can um, pop up an image here. If I can find like a shot of him with... The stones. Uh, at least a shot from the uh, movie. Anyway, this is the um, official. Um, Gauntlet replica, and this is from the movie. Like this is the order from the movie because you do see the power stone, um, space stone, reality stone, and um, soul stone in the um, top row of the gauntlet, and then the mind stone in the center below it, and then the time stone. And although we can't really see the time stone, we can kind of see a green light there, and the colors match exactly like the movie. So that's why I'm assuming that this is the power stone. This is the mind stone. Or the space stone, this is the reality and soul stone. So these this is the mind stone and on the um thumb area there's the time stone. Because that's what I'm gonna go off of for now. Cause it looks like part of this is based off the MCU, but part of it isn't. Cause that's why, because it's the same color scheme. Yeah, because you see the uh green um infinity stone on his on there and I'm gonna just assume that that is the time stone for the time be being until they say otherwise and yeah that's the um, trailer for it um I'm really intrigued about this game um I played ultimate alliance like when I was really young on my 360 I don't have the game anymore because I sold most of my 360 games um yeah um it was, I found it, like, surprising that it's, um, on the Nintendo Switch instead of, like, for everything. But, you know, it is what it is, and I hardly remember what ha happened, because this kind of, not gonna lie, this game kind of looks a little, a little bit like a mo one of those, um, Marvel Mobile games, kind of like, um, those Marvel RPG games, but, um, yeah. Not really too sure, um, how this game is gonna, um, like, go off of. I don't think this is the Avengers project that they were talking about. I think this is just another game that they were doing. I do believe that there is another game that is the Avengers game. Because I don't think this is it. Because this doesn't look like it's living up to the hype. It looks like a, I guess, fun game. But it doesn't look like that impressive, in my personal opinion. But, um, yeah. Nothing too much to go off of. Broke it down. Um, uh, yeah, if... The reviews are good, and I see gameplay, and I think it looks appealing, and I'll get it. If I don't like uh, how it looks on gameplay and stuff, then I won't get it. That's kind of how I like to do things with games. But, um, yeah. So, that's going to be for this um, re um, video. After I finish editing, I'll put this um, part of the video in, and bam, I'll be done. Um, yeah, nothing too much to go off of. So, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, feel free to like, share, comment, subscribe. Turn on notifications so you don't miss any future content. And follow me on Instagram. And yeah. That's going to be it for this video. And yeah, I'll see you next time right here on the channel. See you guys next time.